Are we live? We are good to go. We are live. Awesome. Welcome everyone back to Nigan Seminar and welcome to New Faces or New Names. Um, I'm Shani, one of your hosts. Jackson, my co-host, is in some corner of your screen. He's doing the tech today and I'm going to be your learner's voice. So it's my pleasure to introduce Shoshana Friedman. Rabbi Shoshana Meira Friedman is the um, director of, remind me already, director of professional development at Hebrew College and also an alumna of Hebrew College. And um, if you were with us last week, Deborah Saxman's taught us one of Shoshana's Nibunim, and so we thought it would be really fun to have Shoshana on to teach us herself. Um, and so she's going to share a little bit of background slash Torah about the Nigun that she's going to share with us. And then, as is our custom, I will be learning the Nigunim line by nine from her. Um, and when I sing, you sing, so we can all learn it together. Bechavot Shoshana. Thank you. So it's such an honor to be here. I'm trying something out that may or may not be a field experiment, which is to be on my front porch because my toddler is napping. There's a delivery truck, so there's a couple cars. Um, I was so honored, this, but I think they're, they're all gone now. I was so delighted to um, get to watch the Niggin seminar. And um, last week was a particularly special honor and treat. And I um, had a really powerful experience just about three days ago, I think, which was the, the day that Shani asked if I would want to be on this week, um, was the afternoon of the day in which in the morning, my two-year-old Abraham and I were in our backyard, which is where we spend a lot of time. And we were sitting um, in a little spot that he calls Frog and Toad's Corner, uh, which happens to be under two Eastern hemlock trees. They're pretty young, maybe 20, 25 years old and fairly, um, fairly narrow trunks so they don't look like giant trees but they are in our yard and they're very beautiful and beloved and um, last about maybe four months ago I noticed that they have the little um, woolly egg sacs of the um, of the woolly adelig insect which is a blight that has been devastating the eastern hemlocks of this country um, for actually it, 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 it came over actually many years ago but has made its way west it's an Asian insect and um, I'm sorry, it's made its way from the West to the East. And it's a huge tragedy that's happening in our lifetimes that the Eastern hemlock forests um, are dying. And as climate change warms, this insect can go even further North into more of the hemlocks range. So uh, hemlocks have been a deeply important tree for me. Um, I didn't know their name, but now that I do, and I've gotten into trees, uh, science and identification more, I know that they're the one of the main species in many of the forests where I grew up um, hiking and, and camping. And um, so I was telling Abraham the story of the hemlocks and that they were dying. and. Um, and he sat next to me and he started singing, which is something that he's two and he's actually almost never sings, even though he started to talk a lot. And he just started singing the same line over and over and I got quiet and um, I listened to him and then I just started joining and then I just kind of kept singing. And so what I'm doing today is bending the rules a little. I, the idea is of the Niggin seminar is not to teach something that you've written, um, which I love as a prompt. And yet when Shani asked if I would sing, what I said was I can't, I cannot literally get anything else in my head than this niggin that the hemlocks seem to have taught me and Abraham um, when we got quiet and listened to them. So um, I don't really consider having written what I'm about to share with you, but neither did any other human being. It really felt given as a gift. And, um, and it's the story, it's the story that uh, of them as as they seem to want to tell us. So it begins with uh, um, this line that Abraham was singing and it's the story of the decline. It's, it's from the note that will kind of represent the, the, the stable growth of the hemlock on down. And it goes like this. Shana, you want to try that with me? Yeah. Hi. I'm going to have you stop singing when I sing. So right. I'll, you do it one more time and then I'll try it. Great. Hi, 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 hi. 
Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. So those two together. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, I do the other part again for me. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Beautiful. And then it's the first part again with a slightly different ending. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. So ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. And do the next part again. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Not quite. You got almost. It's that the beginning note is a um. If I sing it through once, it, it, there's, a, there's a shape to it that might be easier than hearing it sort of piecemeal. So from the beginning of part A, and I'll sing it a little faster so you can get the feel, but I think eventually you sing it slower. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay,
And now, yabadam bai, yabadai dai dai. Yabadam bai, yabadai dai dai. Yabadam bai, yabadai dai dai. Yabadam bai. Yabadam bai, yabadai dai dai. Yabadam bai. Want to try that one more time? Yabadam bai, yabadai dai dai. Yabadam bai. Yeah, and then the really fun part, and this is like the the when there's a little opening and there's even more sunlight and they just flourish up. Um, and the exact notes, I mean, it's okay if you kind of guess what comes out. Yeah. So do the, that whole part and then yeah. just that last piece. And that last piece is. Exactly. So um, do you want to try it from the beginning, just you, or sing along with me? I'll sing along with you. Great. Yabadam pai, yabadai dai dai, yabadam pai, yabadagi dagi dagi dagi. Beautiful. Next. All right. So that's, um, that's, that's B1. Now here's B2. Yabadam pai, yaba. So that's the same as B1, but then it's like shooting up. Yabadam pai, yaba dai 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 dai. Yabadam pai, yaba. Just try that. Do you have from the first? Yabadam pai. Great. And then it comes back down to that ground level. Yaba. And then up the octave. Ay, 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 ay. Yabadam pai, yabadai, dai, dai, dai. Yep, and then you kind of keep coming down. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Yabadai, dai, 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 dai. Exactly. The, How are folks doing? Should we try that part again? Yeah. You with so us? Maybe just, just, um, just the second part of part B, and then we'll do all of part B together. So it's gonna start uh, that the, with the first little piece that we know from part A, and then jump up. Yabadam pai, yabadai, dai, 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 dai. Yabadam pai, yabadai, dai, 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 dai. Yep. Let's try all of part B. Starts the same way. Yabadam pai, yabadai, dai, dai, yabadam pai, yabadagi, dagi, 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 dam pai, yabadai, dai, 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 dai. Again. Yabadam pai, yabadai, dai, dai, yabadam pai, yabadagi, dagi, 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 dam pai, yabadai, dai, 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 dai. How's that feeling? Okay. Hey, doing, so, folks. Good. We got it. Move forward. Great. So on. we're going to sing it again. Each of the parts happen. It's four parts. The fourth is very, very easy. Um, so we've already done two. Once you sing part B the second time, as as you would intuit, it it, it resolves. So yeah, but I die, 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 die. That's the second ending of part of part B. Um, so let's just try it from the, from the start and we'll hear the, the decline and the, the grief of this, of the death that's happening and then the story of the, of the new life and the history that the hemlocks are, are reminding us. I, 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 I. Yeah. 
part B. Brilliant. I feel good. Do folks feel good about that? Let's keep going. Okay, so then, um, so those two parts like kind of were given to us under the trees. And I was um, in this kind of state as one may get from having that kind of experience of being pretty um, amazed. And I got quiet later that day. And then this third part came through, which is um, the image that I have in my head is if you would imagine being in a hang glider over like low, right over the tops of the trees of thousands of miles of forest in Appalachia. And um, you would see among other trees, but you would see hemlocks and you would see their spires. They're often like poking up out of the top of the canopy. And so this is the, the story um, of the wind and the rain and the sun and just the joy of that top, of that top layer of grandeur. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, ay, ay. That one more time. Yeah. Um, wait. Give me one sec. This is this is funny. It's it's how you, part of how I, feel like I can say with confidence that I didn't exactly write this. I feel like I'm still learning this part. So <laughs> give me one second. Um, Let's learn it together. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. I got it wrong. Okay, first part of that is. Try that. And, th and now this is like super shooting out of the canopy. So those two together. And then, um, hi. Um, and then there's a little tag, um, which I love in many nigunim, that connects the two. Um, before you go back, that, that connects the two parts of the C section. So um, of the section that is called C. So. That's where we're going, so we'll get there. Um, so let's try uh, first part of C again, and then we'll we'll take the second part. Great. All right, you guys ready for this? All right, yeah. Here so, we go. Ay, 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 ay. Try that. Ay, 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 ay. And then this is the only really part. Ay, ay, ay. Just do that. Ay, ay, ay. And then there's a jump that I find a little challenging, so you may too. So it's ay, 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 ay. ay. That's the next note. So it sounds like this. Ay, 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 ay. We're 
we're going to land right on that ground. Yay, which is also the first note of the again. Yep, exactly. So let's try that part, last part of the, um, the last part of the, of the C part again. All right, all of all of the C part. Beautiful. You think you got it right, Shoshana? <laughs> Have you learned it? <laughs> I can't hear you. Sorry. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think I got it right. There's like a funny slant note that I, I felt like I, I was being asked to put in the niggin, and I just, I think it's too hard, so I'm not. <laughs> one day, maybe. But one day, maybe. <laughs> part yeah. two. They were like, Tune in for part two. Have it be. Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. The second time, I was like, there, it's a complicated enough niggin. <laughs> We're gonna leave that off for the humans among us. Um, it'll it'll have its own evolution. Don't worry. Exactly, someone exactly. someone will put it in if it's not you. Exactly. All right, folks. Exactly. You ready to do that one that second part one more time with Shoshana, and then you'll bring us home. Yeah, but so there's there's a part D, which is incredibly Ooh. easy to sing, but um, very unusual. So what we're gonna do is after when we land on that note in in the C part at the end of C. Ay, 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 ay. We're gonna actually hold it for a full count of four, and then there's a full count of four completely silent. And this is the part of um, tree time. Th this is like the niggin trying to convey to us that the scale of time we're talking about is so inconceivable to us when it comes to trees. It's they move so slow compared to us. <laughs> And they live so long compared to us. Um, and the actions that we do to them um, are so quick. You know, it, the, this great novel, The Overstory, has a beautiful piece, um, a beautiful line. It, it's as though aliens were to come to Earth that, that operated so fast that they were to you know, de decimate the human population, but in the span of about two seconds, where we don't, but, but to them, those two seconds is like 20 years. So the time scale is just so different. And, um, and the, the niggin just wants us to have like main, like a little bit of a taste of what it means to live in the abiding, sustaining time scale of a climax species in a forest. Sorry. That's the local commuter rail. Um, because hemlock species, and this will be my last little piece of, of um, of botany before, um, of ecology. Hemlock species are climax species, which means that by the time they get there, it's only logging or a fire or something like climate change and an introduced pest that would take them out. There's no other tree species that can come in. So they just, they abide. And that's what this is trying to teach us. So the end of C goes, so there's holding the note for four for a full four count holding silence and i really recommend doing a tap on your chest or in your feet for those four counts. Um, and, and then we come back to the same note that we ended on will be the beginning of the decline part in part A. Um, so let's just try that, that piece together from, the, um, from part C. And then we'll, we'll do part C, part D, and then we'll just keep going into the again. Hi, 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 hi. I, 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 I,
Thank you so, so much, Shoshana and your hemlock tree. <laughs> 